Hey friends, welcome to One Little Coder. In this DALI 2 tutorial, we are going to learn how to use DALI 2, an AI project from OpenAI, to edit images. So typically, if you want to edit images, you would use a tool like Photoshop to make certain changes on an image. But if you do not want to use Photoshop like tool, or you do not have expertise to use Photoshop like tool, and also you want to make certain changes using natural language just by telling the AI system what changes you want then you can follow along this tutorial to use DALI 2 to edit images to make changes to the images first if you do not have DALI 2 access you have to request you would ideally join a waiting list that might take months even in my case it took months for me to get access but let us assume that you have an access and you want to make a change and we are going to do that. For example, at the end of this video, we are going to learn how to take a picture of Elon Musk and then make that image like or make Elon Musk hold a Chinese text banner so or board. So we are going to just simply make Elon Musk hold a Chinese board. That image does not exist in real life, but we are going to use AI to make that image. Right now, if you log into DALI 2, this is the landing page that you would see. I'm going to just quickly click upload an image and then this this is the place where I have to select the image. The first image that I'm going to select is the image from the Elon Musk image like this. Maybe I can select the next one. Yeah, this this one. I'm going to take this one and once I upload this image, it's going to give me two options. The first option is edit image. The second option is generate variations. Generate variations will sell, create different variations or different images that look like this. For example, once I click generate variations, you would see cartoons or you would see designs, you would see art that look almost like this. That's that's what generate variation is. I just wanted to show you what happens when you click generate variation. Just remember if you have open AI beta, um, sorry, DALI 2 beta access, you get only 50 um, items, like 50 transactions every day, 50 prompts every day so make it like i i ran out of it a couple of times so use it wisely so here what happens like we took this image and asked for variation and dali 2 has created some some random images with um you know distorted human beings sometimes good human beings but that is not what we want what we want is to take this image and then see if we can edit the image so now i'm going to click done and then click edit image once i click edit image my next task is to tell DALI 2 what is the part of the image that I want to be changed. So I'm going to select everything here. So I'm going to basically select everything here that I want this part to be changed. So this is this is my poor graphic designing skills, but um, but let's see. Right, right now I'm not page like I'm not doing it very slowly. So you can assume that you know my image is not going to be perfect, but um, if you have time, you can do this slightly personally. So this process is called masking. So what we have done at this point is we have basically masked the image. So we have selected the part in the image which we don't, which we want to change. So that's what masking is. So once we do masking, the next step is we have to give a prompt. For example, I can say holding a name board in Chinese. And let's see if it can do so as you know right now at this point we have made some distorted edit so it may not be perfect um, and again like this is a live video so if you if you actually end up seeing distorted image um, my apologies I would uh, redo this exercise again but I'm not going to edit it because I want you to see what exactly is happening here so at this point Dolly is going to give you some tips how to how to have a better DALI image generation but like I said we are not using DALI for image generation rather we are using DALI for image editing so you can see couple of images here and there but you can see this image where Elon Musk has got a um, this is not Chinese this is this is good like even though I had edited a little bit here still it shows some Chinese um, if you know to read Chinese just see if, if it is the right image and uh, here you don't have anything like you can create memes around and you have got images so this is this is basically how you edit an image I, i'm going to show you one more image 
and then I'm going to show you how you can make some changes like close this image click upload and I'm going to select this image of Elon Musk click done and I'm going to select edit image at this point you can see that Elon Musk is standing there Elon Musk um, standing with the rocket and all these things so this is the place where you can change the size of the brush like if you want a very bigger brush like this so you can basically do like this or on the other hand if you want a very smaller brush for example you are going to places like um, his hair let's say then oops then you probably would need a smaller brush so that you don't uh, you don't you don't affect that okay um let's see what happens okay at, at this point we have fairly edited this image now i'm going to say um standing posing from let's say a country germany maybe um yeah let's click generate and then see what happens so at this point as you saw we took an image we masked the parts that we didn't want we masked the parts which we wanted to change or superimpose using ai and after we masked the parts we said posing from germany right right now i think that picture was from elon musk standing um, probably in front of a spacex rocket but what i've said is like we want elon musk to post from germany so i don't know if this is really germany but um, but yeah so like this this looks like maybe i can say german cathedral i don't know if that is going to change anything but uh, let's see um the point is you can now uh, change your natural language or prompt the text that you are giving uh, this is called prompt whatever you give here is called prompt so you can change your prompt and then ask dali to to create new images like you can in fact you can um, you can take one particular image and create more variations of that i'll just quickly show you so elon musk elon musk elon musk elon musk is near a cathedral this this looks better elon musk okay uh, so now what you can do is like if you find for example this image like a good image or this image to be better this image to be better you can make changes for example if you want to make more changes for example posing from um, posing near a german cathedral peering um harry potter hat okay so i'm just saying that i want elon musk or whatever the object that we have selected i want the masked part to say posing near a german cathedral but i also want this particular object like whoever is standing there in which case, in this case it is elon musk to wear a harry potter hat i'm not sure if it will efficiently work but let's let's see if it works out okay it it, it didn't it didn't put harry potter hat i think it has uh, slightly tried to put a hat but uh, it didn't work out a lot so what now you can do is you can probably pick one of the images that you found well for example if you had found one image good now you can use that image to generate more variations for example you can pick one of the images and then click variations here now that is going to help you create more images that look like this and it is highly also possible that it might do the same thing that it did last time where it completely replaces elon musk and then put um, puts a different human being over there or you know a human being who doesn't exist so it can do that um so yeah like like i said it has it has completely removed elon musk from that and then it has put some distorted figures that look like from gta y city there but the but the idea is you can upload an image and then edit an image so that we can make changes for example if you want to create memes if you want to create um, um something different then you can use dali 2 to make changes to your images like you can basically use dali 2 as an image editing service if you have any questions please let me know in the comment section otherwise happy coding peace